What is going on, everyone? Patrick here. Make sure to like and sub it. Let's get into this one. The fans actually won. I, Despite what people thought, your voices were heard and heard loudly. Uh, out of nowhere, Sony decided that in order to play Helldivers 2 on the PC, in which people bought through the Steam platform, suddenly you had to have a PlayStation Network account linked to it, citing reasons, uh, chief among it, seemingly that they didn't want a middleman for them to ban whoever they wanted and uh much to uh the <laughs> hatred the instant hatred and backlash of everyone uh, this announcement uh, was met with like quite literally their player base dropped in the thousands not helped uh by the community managers of arrowhead studios that also we find out had no idea that this was coming uh an even bigger shock and what i'm assuming aside from the mass cancellations and refunds that were happening uh was the fact that there was like a hundred countries 170 steam regions where playstation uh PlayStation Network is not even available, which led to, again, more and more backlash. I think it reached, like, over 300,000 negative reviews, and it was instant. Like, a game went from beloved to hated literally within a span of 24 48 hours the i've never seen this will now be used as an example we'll see if the turnaround is just as quick but uh even the ceo of uh, Arrowhead uh, Studios here, we are discussing that question with our partners at PlayStations and trying to find a solution. That, of course, referencing the fact that some countries can't even get PlayStation Network. So how the hell could they link their accounts? Well, and because people are telling us about the, the Stellar Blade uh, petition, which we're going to uh, end with real quickly. Here we go. This just dropped. I mean, I'm setting this to release early in the morning, but this at the time, this just dropped an hour ago, about uh, about nine o'clock on the West Coast. Uh, Hell Divers fans, we've heard your feedback on the Hell Divers Two account linking update, the May six update, which would have required Steam and PlayStation Network account linking for new players and for current players beginning May thirtieth, will not be moving forward. We're still learning what is, yeah, I bet you are learning. We're still learning what is best for players and your feedback has been invaluable. Thanks again for your continued support of Helldivers 2 and we'll keep you updated on future plans. And I'm sure you were reading that thing along with me the whole time. You weren't staring down below, but yeah, there's Sile. You're certainly still learning, all right. Shout out, are they actually learning? Yeah, they're learning about the canceled money. Now, let me just click on that for reference while we finish. But yeah, they're they're finding out with, with, with wallets when we're starting to cancel uh, refunding the game. But let's not forget this right here should, should show you exactly what's capable when we all band together and very concisely and uh, quickly point out to the problem and find a way to fix it. And in this case, it was, of course, well, then we're just going to refund the game then and we can make a big stink and we won't be playing. You won't have a player base to even have link uh, their stuff. And that should all lead us to this one. So I really hope that by the time I wake up in the morning, this is over 80,000. Uh, but here we go. Let me just refresh one more time. There we go. 79,501. So in the next hour or two, this should be at 80,000. And that's a long way to show you we just won with Helldivers. Now let's get that banned. Now let's get hashtag free Stellar Blade. Let's get this baby to 100,000 by Friday. Let's effing go. We can do it. We can. We literally just showed them that we can stop them from doing dumb shit that we don't like with money. Well, that's what we got to do with hashtag free Stellar Blade. Get those outfits uncensored back to their original form. Get those gore levels back to their original form and fulfill that original pact made with fans when they gave you money for a product that you then changed afterwards when no one was asking for you to do that. So for now, for tonight, celebrate the victory and uh, I guess get back to managing democracy. Uh, this is 100% a win for us. Let's get another one. Let's get another one. Let's go for hashtag free Stellar Blade. But other than that, thank you. Hell, 
seriously, I don't ever let them say that your voice doesn't matter, that we're just screaming at nothing and we're complaining about nothing. You correctly understood what the issue was. I mean, there was a myriad of issues there, but none the likes, none, none the least of which we don't like this pulling it after the fact. You should have had that being a requirement from the beginning. You should have never tried to waive it. And then they did that weird thing where they tried to act like, oh no, it was always supposed to be there. Just, we see that tactic they do a lot. So let's stay focused. Let's go. Hashtag free Stellar Blade. That's the next one. And then when we're done with that, well, then we're going to talk about Warhammer and see if we can give them some support. But right now, I think we're closing down the Helldivers 2 Warfront. That means we can move all those troops over to hashtag free Stellar Blade. Culture War going strong, but the fans uh, were gaining victory every day. This should be a serious morale boost to everyone. Anyway, let me know what you are thinking about this. I like to see all of you celebrating in the comments. Make sure to like, share, and sub if you have done that. Thank you. If you're going to do that, thank you. And let's go. Well, bye.